alert! We finally know who is A on Pretty Little Liars. Are you ready? We found out in the season two finale titled Unmasked that A is Mona. Now it might seem super simple, but it's definitely not. So let's start with a little recap action. The episode surrounds a masquerade ball, the girls look amazing in their dresses, and the whole mask thing keeps us guessing about some people's identities, including the girl in a black swan themed gown. This person is definitely hanging out with a no longer blind Jenna and Lucas, and they're all very suspicious. But before the big gala, clues including a postcard lead the girls to a creepy motel. No one is around except for a hooded stranger who is spying on them. They figure out that Allie checked in twice there under Vivian's name, and we learn via Mona that Allie was busy watching A. When Spencer realizes this, fast forward to the gala where there are definitely some romantic moments. I mean, did you see that hashtag Ezria goes public got posted on the video screen? Well, she and Mona rush back to the motel as a duo and go into room two. It has hundreds, if not thousands of photos of Allie, her personal belongings, and more. Then with hints, like a gum wrapper in Allie's diary as Mona offers gum to Spencer, and then the big reveal straight from Mona, we get to see and figure out that Mona is A. Apparently, it was all about revenge to her as the girl stole away her friend, Hannah. The rest of the girls are able to take a shortcut to catch up to them on the road, and after a scuffle, Mona winds up falling off the cliff. But she's still alive, people! She's taken to a mental ward where this is the explanation from Dr. Sullivan, yes, she's back, about Mona as A. Mona is in a perpetual state of hyper-reality. The adrenaline rush that accompanied her feelings of empowerment and her high level of intelligence fueled Mona's ability to be seemingly all-knowing and omnipresent. Then the episode ends with the coroner taking away a dead body, and it might just be Maya. Basically, A delivered on that promise that someone would wind up in a body bag if the girls didn't listen to A's orders by midnight. We're left with a visit to Mona from another part of the we making up A. It's not just her. The person is wearing red, and Mona says that she has done everything that the person has asked her to do. And that is the end of Unmasked.